What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Gemini, and you enjoy more content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This free channel collective reading for Sana Gemini. This could resonate if you have Gemini any aspects of your chart Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midhaven, Jupiter, charge. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading for Sana Gemini. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, type your sister profile. The link's in the description box below. Um, it's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. And thanks for all the recent donations. I truly appreciate them from the bottom of my heart chakra. Um, this could resonate if you have Gemini, any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Mid Haven, Jupiter charts. I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node and Mid Haven signs for additional message or messages. Um, these are... Um, these are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, so one may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. Um, don't force any message or messages that don't apply for you in your personal specific situation. It's like forcing a square into a hole. Don't fit it, don't fit, okay? These are free general collective readings, okay? If you like a personal reading, the um, link's in the description box below. The information's in the description box below, okay? Um, love you guys. Okay. So this is for 831 in 2022 to 9-3 of 2022. Okay. So, um, for a lot of you guys, I feel it could possibly resonate in the four day range if it does, but for some, it could resonate outside the four day range because there's millions of billions of people in the world. Okay. And tons of Gemini's. I did receive one channel message as I was meditating on your energy, um, uh, for this just in 96. I heard, um, a shocking visitor at the door soon is what I heard. Some a home, some a workplace situation. So you plug it in how it resonates. A shocking visitor at the door soon. Some a workplace situation, some a home situation. So you uh, have to plug them up. Message or messages that apply in your own specific situation, how they resonate, okay? Some kind of shocking visitor at the door soon, whether it's a home situation or a business or workplace situation, okay? High Priestess Upright, Ten of Wands Upright, Nine of Wands Upright. Someone new is about to come into an exit's life soon. Your ex is life. It's going to bring up feelings there you never thought would be there. You thought they were gone. Someone new is about to come into your ex's life. It's about to bring bring feelings you never thought would were there is about to arise. Um, I heard uh, you thought the feelings were gone for your ex, but um, whoever this is about to come into your ex's life, um, now it could be a masculine or feminine ex. You have to plug the ex into your own specific story and situation if it does apply for you. But for a lot of you guys, this is going to happen in the next four days. This is what I'm presuming. For some, it could happen outside the four-day range. But um, wh whoever this ex is to you, Gemini, um, it could be an ex-spouse, an ex-fiance, ex-girlfriend, boyfriend, ex-dating partner, or ex-sexual connection, um, whoever that ex is. Or it could be a baby mama, baby daddy. But however that resonates, you thought the feelings for your ex were gone, like gone and dead and dormant inside of you. But it sounds like when this ex comes in, um, this is the uh, person about to come into your ex's life. It's going to give you lots of burdens. Um, Ten of Wands, the biggest burdens in the crow. I think mental conflict here or emotional conflict uh, because they're going to come in with lots of desire, drive, and motivation towards your ex um, is what it's seeming like in the cards and the messages. But you thought the feelings were dormant for your ex, but basically they're about to come, they're about to come back to the surface. Um, I think they might confuse you or, or something of that nature. I'm not sure. Only you know how you're going to feel if this resonates for you. It's, uh, I feel for a lot of you guys, it's going to happen within the next four days, but you plug it in how it resonates. For um, some of you guys, um, your ex could be a high priestess or a high priest. Um, Lots of inner knowing. Um, they know a lot of things intuitively inside themselves. Highly intuitive, all um, inner knowing um, kind of energy. Um, they could be a high priestess or a high priest. But 
it's going to give you lots of burdens, um, mental, like mental, emotional conflict, not physical burdens. Because this person is about to come in with lots of desire, drive, and motivation towards your ex. Now, whoever this ex is to you and however they apply. But they're coming in with the Knight of Wands energy. For some, they could actually physically be younger, like 18 to 25, or just act younger. Like lots of, think of like zaddy energy. Just saying. Um, uh, they could be older with lots of zaddy type energy or like 18 to 25 but coming in at the night it could be an aries leo sage coming into um your ex's life or somebody taking on the aries leo sage energy lots of desire drive and motivation you plug it in how it resonates for some your ex could be a taurus or a libra because this is taurus or libra energy or not they could just be taking on the high priestess or high priest energy you plug it in how it resonates um gemini These people align energetically, and they're about to hit it off. These people are about to align energetically, and they're about to hit it off. So, same energetic frequency and wavelength there. They have not met yet, it sounds like, but it sounds like they're about to, and they're about to hit it off. So, I think you're going to have the um, ten of wands, the burdens here for you is um, you're going to have you're going to have to deal with your emotions. Your emotions here and your inner conflict here um, because you're not going to, I think you're going to have emotions here that you didn't realize for, it's like they're dormant, but they're about to come to the surface because um, it sounds like these two people are very compatible energetically, for sure, for sure, for sure. So you plug it in how it resonates, Gemini. All right, that's it. All right, hope this helped and namaste.